you ever find yourself wondering if there really is a higher source out there that's helping you to live your life, to live your best life? Hi, I'm Reverend Allie Bierman, and I'm very glad you joined us here today for a gathering of Metaphysical Ministry International. Well, what is metaphysics? Metaphysics is about how you create your reality and your thoughts and decades and decades of scientific research actually verify and prove the truth that your thoughts are creating everything in your world from your DNA. Yes, that's right, it's not set. Your thoughts change it to what appears in your life, to what you attract. It's all the energy you're putting out because of the thoughts you're thinking, and you can only attract what vibrates in harmony with you. So you want to know, well, how do you change your thoughts? We start every week with a happy share. That's something that leaves you feeling good, happy, at peace. And I have a really cool happy share every week. Well, always do. There have been three major projects that I've been working on for a long time now. I finished two of them. And the last one is going to be done in the next couple of months, moving forward, and I can move forward faster on it. Yeah, I'm really happy that I was able to do that. Because it means I'm healing. I couldn't do the work I've been able to do lately unless I'm healing. So, do you ever wonder why you go through the pain that you do? Well, you know, if the universe is throwing stumbling blocks on your path, it's not to slow you down. It's not to make you give up. You know, I used to think when paths, when my paths were strewn with obstacles because I wanted to go this way but I couldn't because there was a block or something came up with family and I had to stop and take care of that. I used to think they were detours, keeping me from where I wanted to go. But they weren't detours. Every single meandering of my path took me someplace I didn't know I needed to go so I could become someone I wouldn't have become otherwise so that I'd have the skills and the ability to take actions I wouldn't have been able to take being who and how I used to be. Well, the universe is doing the same thing for you. See, the universe talks to us constantly. That's one reason I meditate first thing every morning. I get all kinds of information when I meditate. If I have a question I ask, and I don't just ask when I meditate. You see, I know how to talk to my spirit. I know how to talk to my angels and my guides. I know how to talk to the universe. And all of them are talking to us all the time. I don't necessarily mean in words that you hear in your ear. It might be a sign that you see. It might be music that you hear. It could be a feeling, an intuition. The list goes on and on. If you want more information on that, you be sure you go over there and you contact me and we'll find a better way to talk to help you to understand the communications coming at you because once you do, your life gets so much easier. Nothing comes your way to stop you. Everything that comes your way that you think is here to stop you, it's an opportunity to grow through it. That's how you get to where you really want to be in life. Now, if you're on the ministry page and you look up there, you will see a page called Hold the Space For. If there's something that you want to manifest in your life and it's just not happening, let us know. Tell us down there. It will appear up there on the page. And tell your family and friends and you too. Come back at least once a week. Read every name and every request. You don't have to know who the people are. I guarantee the universe does. And because you're saying it, the moment that you hold that space for somebody to create that reality or somebody does it for you, in that moment, zoom, message goes right to the universe. There's no delay. There's no delay. And the thought form for each person repeating your name and request gets bigger 
and bigger. And then the universe says you're serious about it. Now, if you haven't done so already, go in over there. And if you give me your name and email address, I'll give you a copy of how to take your first steps on your spiritual path. I really appreciate your click and like and share. Because you know what? Suffering isn't meant to destroy you. Suffering is meant to build you fast. I wish you a week of many blessings and discovering that every crisis is an opportunity to step in a new direction. Blessings.